guys don't forget to smash the like button and subscribe so now we're gonna go through www.greatopair.com so you're gonna type it on and then dot com and push that search here you go find jobs hard care I get started to make a profile so we're gonna go down so that you can understand we are go how to become an au pair host family if you're a host family or a family that find an au pair you can do some profile here too uh, what's the meaning of au pair you can read that one too if you don't understand yet and au pair versus nanny what's the differences you can read that one so that you can enlighten what's the meaning of au pair and there's a there's a um words also that uh, what to be like an au pair in america so let's scroll it up then let's get started to make a profile so let's type my name type tina and last name lombard my email i just made this email just for this video so you can uh, understand to make a profile and walk you through it so yeah lombardina35 at gmail.com and then phone number uh, it's not really my phone number guys i just made it you know just for this video so that i can help you and then you will put there i am a job seeker and then put there's a lot guys if you want to be a nanny a babysitter but i just put over because i just make this video for au pair so let's put your my country whatever country you are there is a lot in here and it's all over the world so i'll put philippines and i put my province uh, it is late and my city town i just put bye bye late there you go and then postal code guys whatever postal code in your own province or in your town just put it on there you go we're here in credentials job types what type of jobs you want they have tutor personal assistant so let's put au pair and then years of education I'm a high school graduate, so I just put 11 or less. And then my language that I speak is not really much for the requirements, but you can put. So I just put English. I'm gonna find some Filipino if they have it. Oh, well, actually, they have Tagalog, but I just put English. So. Yeah, I have a valid driver's license. Yes, I will use my car for work. Uh, I just put no there. And can you provide references? Yes. And password security, your birth date. So I just put January and 17. And 1993. Let's find 1993. There you go. So, a security question. So, I put favorite food and pancet. I love pancet. It's a Filipino dish, guys, if you don't know it. Gender, female, my nationality. Filipino, my relationship.
Asian Catholic oh, valid passport for uh, yes I have a valid passport so oh, I put two items I should have to put just one on it so I have to change it for just one passport it at Albania <laughs> and then there you go and visa I don't have visa yeah because if you're gonna apply for an au pair so you don't have visa yet but if you're already an au pair to another country so you must put one or either or how many visa you have so countries I like to work uh, by the way, this is how far will you travel for work? So just put worldwide guys if you want to do that There's another choices if you want and then countries I'd like to work in So yeah, they have lots of choices guys whatever country you want uh, What country you want to travel? So yeah, do it. They have lots in Europe I can even go to Asia. So you want to go Korea, Japan, Switzerland, uh, United States. Yeah, guys, United States right now is not really getting some temporary visa yet because of COVID. So yeah, but I will inform you if they're gonna go through get another oper again. They're gonna, you know, get the uh, rules about that. So just, you know, get notification, push that notification button on the subscribe subs uh, on my channel so that I can uh, inform you all about that. So here you go. We're here in the city town. On what country you wanna go? I just put Ontario because I really don't know what town in Ontario I should be so and then the salary you're expected so I just put uh, $200 to $300 and preference currency if you want to do USD United States dollar you can put that or you can change it I am comfortable working around pets yes and then you're gonna put your height, your weight, and then your dietary consideration. If you know me, I don't have allergies, so I just put everything. And then my health, it is excellent. And do you smoke? No, I don't have tattoos. And then I don't have piercing other than my ear pierce. Can you swim well? Yes. Are you trained in first aid? Yes, because I trained here. I study for it here in United States, guys. So, yeah. And I will work in home where the employer smoke. No. Here, where Uber help employers get a realistic picture. So I put something in it. I said I'm Tina, and I am hard working. and honest but respectful and i love kids you know just make them not comfortable to go to your profile because you know just be honest in this profile guys because that's the best key to find a good host family when a host parent so early date i'm available you put your availability there what year your availability to go to that country that you're applying for latest date i'm available so i put the same and then shorter term of stay how many months you're gonna stay there and then longest of how long you're gonna stay in that country 
so I'm looking for full time and I prefer live in so that you know you'll be free and shelter and food and then your availability if you're gonna you know talk to them so if you don't have any you know work jobs and then you're just focusing on that application so you put all then years of paid experience about two years are you married of course no because in oper you have to be single i am part of a couple now i will work for a single parent uh, no preferred family age group so i uh, just put no preference preferred family nationality so uh, I put there can Canada so I put a Canadian family so here I am open to provide this additional service so it's I prefer you just put all checked but it's up to you guys whatever you like and then I am infant care qualified yes because I have two years experience qualification to take care of infant so here's guys you can put your you know like some details there in the box so that the family that can see your profile oh there you go we're done it says congratulations Sina and your profile is almost complete will guide you through the remaining steps so the last one is only include your jobs in your country i put no because you know i put their canada so I put no and there it's all done you just put your you know you can just add videos and photos of you and then yeah you're all set it up and then you can go to my account that you can check your you know account there and then you can add some photos i've prepared if you want to put some photos you have to put like photos that you have with the kid that you have experience to take care of so the family then gonna see your profile can see you that you know you take care of kids you have experience with the kids so that would be great and then you can add some videos so there you go that's the profile that i made and then here you go guys and then the great over we're gonna send you some email uh, with their um email address and then your password so that you can go through to the uh, website again and just put your email there and your password that you can add more documents there and yeah so thank you so much guys for watching i hope um i help you to go through this if you have more comments and questions just comment down below and please don't forget to subscribe and like thank you thank you so much and always wear a smile every day thank you so much